all you need to do is go down to the NPC description below, you will find this chest, click on raw, grab the URL, and create a new directory to store the script in. I'm just going to call it if that. Then let's go right into it. Alright, so we're going to download this file. I'll paste in the file URL here and name it script.sh. Now that we have this file, we need to edit it and put in our GitLab URL, private token, and username. I've gone ahead and created a private token, so all you need to do is copy that and then paste it here and uh, pasting the username and then the path to your dumpster directory and active directory so we'll just do home slash github slash dumps and then here we're going to do home slash github slash backup let's save this file And give it the executable permissions. So let's do chmod plus x in the script. Now all you need to do is run this file and it'll start fetching your repositories, limits, uh, issues, all of that. And as you can see, we list the, directory, uh, the, the contents in this directory. You can see that we have backups, logs, and the script itself. So we can go to backup, there we have our appropriately named GitLab backup, then date, then time. We can view the contents of this backup. It's going to take a while to load, so let's be patient. There you see it. Um, this is all the stuff that's been backed up. We have our issues. Snippets, projects, then we have repositories, all of the stuff that's in that repository. Alright, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video.